George Takei. Mr. Sulu later wrote that Bill seemed totally immune to the sensitivities or the efforts of those he worked with. Bill Shatner hogging the stage? No. Not the Bill Shatner I know, no. <laughs> but what about the Bill Shatner who, during the making of Star Trek, also made The Transformed Man? an album some listeners thought should have been called The Transformed Ham. On it, Shatner recited poetry and the lyrics of pop songs like Mr. Tambourine Man. Mr. Tambourine Man. And that's the end of the song, by the way, him just yelling, Mr. Tambourine Man! Mr. Tambourine Man! Yeah. I remember thinking it was great. I remember thinking... My dad is really brave and cool. If he's a brave guy, he'll just go out and do something. And he doesn't really put too much stock in the outcome. He just, just throws it out there. If it sticks to the wall, great. If it doesn't, he, he doesn't dwell on it too long. Well, you'd be proud, too, if Captain Kirk was your father. Other people's dads go to offices and don't, don't put on outfits and run around and stuff. It occurred to me that maybe not everybody's dad, you know, worked on a spaceship. Still, when Shatner took his daughters to work one day, they discovered a spaceship could be just as boring as any other dad's office. And that was just fine with him. My dad thought it would be wonderful for my sister and I, my sister Liz and I, to uh, experience what acting was about so that we would never want to become actresses. My older sister and I were on one of the episodes, actually we played two little kids that in reality were like 300 years old. So, um, he would get us up, you know, like at 5.30 in the morning, which already wasn't starting out very well. <laughs> if you're not intimately involved in the process, you're just kind of sitting there, and it's not really that fun. After about two days, three days, I just I just remember breaking down and crying. And, you know, Dad, I don't want to do this anymore. I want to go home. And, and they were about to do a big scene with all the kids, and I had to be in it. And so I, he took me backstage, back behind the set, and calmed me down. And then once the camera started rolling, he came over to me and put his hand on my head, and uh, so I got my semi-close-up, and after that, I got to go home. 